Hey guys, what's up? Welcome to Audio Tips. In today's tutorial, uh, we're, I'm going to basically take you guys into uh, my Logic Pro uh, software, going to Audio Effects. I'm going to show you guys a Waves plugin called the Rec 6. I'm going to open it up, show you guys what kind of plugin, uh, what kind of options the plugin has to offer. Uh, basically, give you guys a little overview on it, show you guys why I like it. Um, get you guys just a little bit more familiar with it. Uh, please keep in mind that you do have to have certain Waves bundles in order to open some of these plugins. So don't think they just come with the software. But for right now, we're going to go into audio units down to Waves. We're going to go to Rec 6 right here. We're going to open it up. It's going to look a little something like this, a little bit bigger than the than the other Recs. Uh, it gives you four knobs to sweep the frequency spectrum with. It works the exact same. you got your output here in case you uh, clip. Uh, you got your gain. You got your frequency. You got your cue. And you got your curves right here, your options, your type of curve that you guys want. And basically remember that as soon as the number is highlighted that means it's active if it's not highlighted that means it's not active I can't I can't really hear it on the vocal unless I activate it but uh, this is basically it great uh, equalizer go ahead and check it out this is this is uh, mostly used for people who, who want more uh, more e want to do more EQ into a vocal uh, uh, perhaps the rec 2 is, is more uh, is more so for if you just want to do minimal uh, minimal uh, frequency changes. Uh, but this is basically it. I hope you guys enjoyed and learned something new. And uh, please subscribe.